Hello everyone, welcome. In this video, we're going to be testing out some color schemes for B1 battle droids using speed paints by Army Painter. In Star Wars Legion, a unit of B1s contains six to eight battle droids. And since these guys are the bread and butter of the Separatist army, I know I'm gonna be running several units of them in most lists. So I'd kind of like to have a different color scheme for each unit. So I'm gonna be testing out nine different colors on these battle droids. To prep these models, I based them by super gluing some small bits of gravel and sand to about half the bases. Then I sporadically layered grout on top of the gravel and the rest of the bases, tapping off the excess. After that, I mixed up some watered down PVA glue and I brushed that onto each base. That was to help seal the grout. Once that was dry, I primed these models with my airbrush. This is a cheap airbrush, but for priming purposes, it works just fine. If you think I need a better airbrush and are feeling super generous, I have some airbrushes on my Amazon wish list, which is linked below, along with some other things. I used a three to one ratio of Vallejo gray surface primer and water. I sprayed three coats of that onto each model. I tried using grim black on the weapons. I painted one model with a gray base coat and one model with a base coat of silver. The silver undercoat looked way better to me, so I decided to use that for the rest of the weapons. But I did have to clean them up a little bit after that. I dry brushed some army painter gun metal on top of that, and after that they looked pretty good. And then I decided to dry brush a little bit of matte white to create some highlights on the edges and the tops of the models. So with all that done, let the color testing begin. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, let the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way, to win it life, I never miss that stack, taking big swings, push hand to the back, put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag, cause I sing what I mean, and I bring it to the mad life, ain't got time to kill, I got time to fail, I took the red pill, I know life's short, so I wanna live real, but how's it supposed to feel? They wanna say my name, but they holding back They wanna say they hate, but they know it's cap I ain't play no games, I just do that's fact And I don't feel no shame, it's a mood you lack I go crazy, nah, but I ain't lazy Track after track, I work on this shit daily Pass me the jack, right as fuel got me hazy About to unpack all these shit I've been chasing I've got visions in my head Like memories after death To be a legend instead Of something you can forget I'm living up every breath I'd rather leave than be led I'll fill the seats as I spread with every word that I've said. For the bases, I covered them with Agrillin Earth, 
which gave them a cracked earth effect. And once that was dry, I mixed up a color using a crusted sore and some brown colors. And I kind of wet blended that with a desert yellow. I put a thin coat on so the cracks would show through. And then I thought, why not test out some speed paints as washes? So I picked out three colors that I thought might work for this. Uh, Blood Red, Fire Giant Orange, and Sand Golem. And after some testing, I came to the conclusion that I liked the orange best. So I washed off the other two and I covered all the bases in the orange. Finally, I dry brushed Desert Yellow onto each base and painted the base rims black. Overall, I'm pretty impressed with this line of paints so far. Um, I really like the Pallid Bone. Obviously, that's the classic B1 color. I think it looks great. I also really like Sand Golem. I kind of want to try mixing both of those together to get like a, a mid-tone between those two. Uh, I also like Holy White and Runic Gray for these droids. So I think I might work with those four colors for my army. Um, the rest of them look good too. I think a lot of these would look better if they had a, an undercoat of uh, silver or some kind of metallic. I've seen a few other videos where people used a metallic base coat and I thought it looked pretty good. So I might try that with some of the other droids. I don't plan on doing a ton of mini painting videos like this. It's just what I'm putting my time towards right now. So it makes sense for me to make a video on it. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. Do you like these colors? Do you uh, want to see more videos like this? If you found this video helpful at all, I'd appreciate it if you would like and subscribe. That would help me out a lot. I hope you have a good day and I will see you later.